Hey, hey, it's Happy Nirvana. So I'm back again with a snack taste examination of the British culture. Today, we got. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, yeah, I think four of them out. Got a couple of Cadbury's here. Cadbury Milk Tiffin. Oh, I haven't. I didn't even look to see what Tiffin is. Oh. It's dried grapes. Grapes, grapes, and biscuit. I got this solely because there is a town in Ohio called Tiffin. So I thought, mm, I'll try it. <clears throat> Dairy milk caramel. And I think this is going to be straightforward. It, it's uh, yeah, milk with caramel. Then we got Hobbits. Minty dark chocolate coated mint cream. And then we'll leave off with. We'll end with Elite Chocolate Tea Cakes. These look like the hollow cakes covered in thick milk chocolate. They don't look like oh mallow cakes thick chocolate um yeah so I thought those would probably be uh, maybe like moon pie because it almost looks like it's got a uh, biscuit bottom on it so we'll see kind of how they shake out with comparing to a moon pie Start with the tip in here if I can get her open. And it helps to open it on the side that says open here. Right? Right. So your typical Cadbury squares. Not focusing. Focus! And you can see the little bumps there. Right off, I'm going to tell you, I'm not fond of the grapes. Other than that, not bad. Yeah, caramel is like... Little bubbles. Ooh, that caramel. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That is stretchy. Can you probably can't. Look at caramel, you cannot go well. You can go wrong, but it's hard to go wrong with it. Pop. Pop open here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Had a, had a little pudding in there. You can smell the mint as soon as it goes in the bag. And, uh, get your little mint balls here.
I was expecting something totally different. I was expecting uh, chocolate just to be a covering in the mint center to be like real soft and it's not. You see it's a literally, literally a uh, bowl of minter. Why not? Um, It's a definitely a strong artificial mint taste. And when I think creams, I think of something that's soft, and those aren't really, I mean, they're, they're not hard, but they're not soft. Paying a stretch of imagination. Alright, gonna finish off with the tea cake. I do not have a cup of tea here with me, so. Don't wanna hear that if I don't like them, it's because I didn't have tea. Ooh. I well, was not expecting these to be an in individual packages. That, that makes it nice. If they were going to be in individual packages, I would have opened big packs and just had a smaller pack ready. I think we have cookies called mallows that are just about like this. I don't eat them a lot. That's why I say I think. They're alright. They're not something I would eat every day. Maybe they're better with tea. So this is going to be a surprising one. Because it's... This will be one of those that, I'm going to say, with anything, I don't regret buying because you don't know until you try it. So, you know, I'm not going to sit here and say anything that I try, and even if I don't like it, I'm not going to say 100% you should not buy these except Smarties. I would, I would not recommend those to anybody. <laughs> so, yeah, the... Dairy milk tiffin. Um, if you like grapes, you might it might be okay for you. I I wasn't uh, particularly fond of the. I mean, only they only have like one little piece of grape and two pieces I eat. Caramel good. These again, not exactly what I expected. I expected something to be. I expected the cream to be a lot softer in the middle. And, yeah, definitely a really strong artificial mint taste. I mean, I guess you say most stuff that's mint flavored is artificially flavored, but it just really feels kind of, it feels fake. And then, uh, tea cakes, um, once again, maybe I'll have to try these with a cup of tea. Um, maybe that'll swing, swing my opinion of them. I am not a huge fan of, uh, marshmallow fluff. Um, now, I say that, but I do like, 
the, uh, yeah, I said it. My brain just died. But live on camera. I like the American uh, things from Chattanooga. <laughs> Moon pies. Thank you. Thank you for brain for finally showing up. So, with that, we're going to wrap this one up. I still have a surprise in store within the next couple of videos. Um, I try to record these videos in batches, so that's why you'll see wearing the same shirt, and, like in a Monday video and a Thursday video. But um, that way I can keep the snacks fresh, as fresh as possible. So, with that being said, we're going to wrap this one up. Once again, don't be afraid to try new things. That's that's what a lot of this is about. And um, as I've discussed on my uh, some of the previous update videos, uh, eventually I'm going to run out of things that I want to try that's British. And that's when I'm going to start going into trying other countries or even just trying American stuff that maybe I'm not tried before. Trying a lot of organic stuff, um, healthier foods, whatnot. Just trying something different. So, until next time, this is Sapphire Navarana saying, bye.